Ben Horner for MBTV here with Billy Boy Bird. Um, well, this year's first headline in your hometown. How was it? Oh, fuck. Sorry. <laughs> it was amazing, you know. Got the win. Box. Put the fella down three times. I couldn't have asked for any more. The crowd were unbelievable tonight, you know. I've sold over 100, 150 odd, no, 180 odd tickets. And to do, have a fight like that, win the belt under all of them. Being in my new hometown, Braintree, you know, it was an honour and uh, I'm over the moon. Uh, more, I can't take nothing away from that kid who I boxed. He is one strong, very underrated fighter and, you know, I didn't, I didn't box to the best ability, you know, weren't the best me, but I got the win. I put him down three times, you know, it caught me, caught me with a hell of a shot and won't take no credit away from him. It was a big shot he caught me with and I had to dig in deep there and it didn't put me down. Um, I got, got a little bit of a cut. Um, nice one, cheers, Joe. Um, yeah, I just put just put everything into it. I had to dig in deep, you know, and I couldn't rush the fight. I had to take my time, and that's what I done. And I come out with, uh, I gave it. I think there was two points in it. I think, mm -hmm. but yeah. I didn't think it was that close. But I think because I was sitting off on the back foot a bit. Sorry, about that. <laughs> let go then. And uh, I sat off the back foot a bit. It was a bit hard mm -hmm. to. Uh, to not give it more to him than it was to me, you know. I didn't want to rush things because I could have made a mistake. And I knew that last round, that's why I sat up on that last round, because I knew what he was going to try and do. He had to knock me out to win. And I knew that's what he was going to do. And that's why I had to tuck up and just take take the shots away from him. And that's what I've done. And now I'm walking out of here with the belt, happy as Larry, and ready to go and celebrate with all my fans and all my family. And, uh, no drinking? No, nah, no, I won't. No drinking. No drinking. I, I've got, I might, I'm back in the gym on Monday, so I'm going to. Just have a nice little day tomorrow with the family and a few other See, little, okay. little loved ones and <laughs> we'll go from there. But uh, I just want to thank every everyone, all my sponsors. It just Without all them I wouldn't be able to do, do the job that I love full time and I just want to thank everyone. Thank this man here, my brother. He's, uh, he's a kit man really, sort of everything. No, he's a good lad, you know, he comes out at Tenerife first, does pushes me, so me dad. Fine. Just everyone who's involved with me, I just want to thank you so much. And another great show for Shamrock, and hopefully this is a it's a venue now we can keep for the future and it's so bringing boxing my way now. So what was it like? You you went out to Tenerife, spent some time with Liam Walsh, Ryan Walsh, Michael yeah. Walsh, all oh, of them out in Tenerife. That um, was great. To then have Liam in your corner, you know. Like, yeah, Liam. Before I went out there, Liam he, Liam said to me, you know, throw your right hand, you know, because he's been watching me sparring and things like that, and he said. There's a few things we was changing on my right hand way I was throwing it. I was throwing it a bit, a bit weird, and he, he was telling me what to do. And he said, just every time of self for straight right down the middle, you catch him all the time. And he was right, and I caught him with a straight right, and he went down, you know. And it was just something that we'd been practicing on. But having, having Liam, who's the British Commonwealth champion, you know, I can't, I couldn't have asked for any more than that, you know. And to get experience, like words from him, from from the corner as well as alongside of Graham and John, it was. It's an honour, so and I just want to thank everyone for coming, everyone who bought all the tickets. And bring on the next one for yeah, Team Bird. Yeah, finally, Bird. that's what I was going to get on to. When is the next one? Do we know? Have we oh, I just leave idea? it. I leave it all down. Leave it all down to to my team now, and I'll just like I said, I'll have tomorrow off, maybe maybe Monday, but I'll be back in next week, definitely into the gym and get ready for the next one, and I'll go sit down and see see what's offered to me now. So, I so that was a big test for me tonight. Got through it. Good eight rounds. Oh, so bring on the next Came one. On Team, Team Bird. Bird. Thank you very Cheers, much, guys. Mate. Speak to you soon. Nice.